Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of No Man's Sky. Alrighty, when we left off, uh, my ship was here. Uh, we ended up, uh, of course, with this, um, but we also ended up in a new planet. Uh, several hundreds of thousands of light years probably away from where I originally was. So, you know, I traveled a bit, um, <laughs> but beyond that, um, really the only other thing I have to do is follow the mysterious signal echo, but with the superheated storm, that makes that a little bit more of a, uh, daunting challenge. Plus, I hadn't actually looked into that, uh, beacon there, so... There's that. Ooh, lightning. Nice. Give me more of that. Yeah. Don't get enough lightning where I live, so having it in-game is just a blast. <laughs> but anyway. At this point, we're just going to wait out the storm. It'll take a little while, I'm sure. But then we'll do the traveling afterwards. Sounds good to me. Delightful, finally. Alrighty, now that we have that going for us, we're just going to wait for the temperature to drop below 100. Because then I don't have to worry about <laughs> jumping out and do it. And recharge. Screw it. Alright, now we go ahead and go to the distress beacon here. Scenario. Iteration 23118766 1T. Deleted. Boundary separation failure likely. Vessel 16 empty. Cause sentinel intervention deliberate transfer. Analysis. Fresh iteration generated. Anomaly containment prepared. Broadcast received. Traveler anomaly detected. Anomaly is compliant. Position locked. System integrity scan initialized. Okay. That's a thing. I guess. I don't have that. It's on my ship. It's on my frigate, which is thousands of miles away. More like millions, but nonetheless. Okay. Put that in the exosuit and grab whatever's in there. Ooh, a Gek Relic. Nice. Also grab whatever's in here. It's nothing. Ooh. Trictile ammunition. That's something. Decent, at least. Some sodium. And what else? No, that was it. Okay, cool. Ooh! I gotta I got take my opportunity. Get it from here. There we go. Beautiful. Alright, now we head in that direction. And also scan things along the way. Because money. Rurifite. Rurifite? I don't know how to pronounce that, but that is weird. Okay, ooh. Ferrite dust and sodium. How could I turn that down? Two essential ingredients to living. Oh! Okay, not exactly what I meant to do, but it's fine. Let's see if there's anything special in here. The answer is kind of? But not really. Not really enough to jump down there for. Cobalt with salt. Isn't that typically how cobalt is? Oh, that is a lot. That's a lot here. No way I'm turning that down. Whoop! I accidentally killed something I didn't analyze first. Ah, and it has paraffinium in it. Oh, you were the thing that was making noise. Well, hi there, little bug. Well, I mean, I say little. <laughs> bigger than most normal ones, but... Nonetheless, the point stands. Ooh. Some more unidentified minerals. What we got here? More ferrite dust and paraffinium. I mean, 
I won't turn down paraffinium, but right now with my frigate so far away, I can't really store it anywhere. So, doing that would be a little inventory filling a little too quickly. Time to burn through these crystals here. There we go. You know what? This planet isn't half bad. Superheated storms I could do without, but otherwise it isn't too bad. Yeah. I think I've scanned most everything by now. Except for that thing. I have no idea what that is. Is that a natural rock outcropping? That's Cool, but weird. What, what the what? What the f What the f As I was just saying, man, this planet's pretty cool. A thing that would murderize me in a second. <laughs> For fun. <laughs> well, hey. At least I know that that's a thing now. <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and get back to trying to get that signal echo, huh? Should probably do it with my actual ship, now that I think about it. Oh, yeah, those are evil things. It'll at least get the creatures away so I don't accidentally harm them in the process. A lot of oxygen. A lot of oxygen. Also, there's apparently some... Whoop! Hidden minerals down here. Buried a mineral formation right here. Oops, I keep hitting the wrong button when I mean to do this one. Nice. And let's see. Glowing mineral. Not bad. I'm gonna store that. Not terrible. And I should get to my ship. Where did I put my ship? Where's my ship? Over there. Ah, screw it. Oh, jeez. <laughs> okay. Alright. Right here. Good enough. Beautiful. And let's fly our way there instead. Take a lot less time than just trying to walk it. Yeah, see how much less time it takes? I should have just been doing this from the start. But no, I wanted to foot travel because I could grab things. Making so small. I need to think big. It's a planet. It's going to be tons of resources. All to me. All available to me. Okay, the signal echoes approximate location is here. I'm sure not exactly on the rock, but I'm not going to turn down the possibility that it is on the rock. Uh, I'm trying to find a good place to land. Uh, this is good enough. There's enough little things here. Beautiful. Oh, it might be on the rock. <laughs> From the look of the amount of distance I have to travel, 
might actually be on the rock. Okay, uh, let's get in there. Get this thing. Ta da. Ooh, got four out of that. Hells yeah. Alright, let's switch back to Mining Beam. Get these Knowledge Stones. Corvax word for new. Ooh! I need this. I need this for things and stuff. Stuff and things. Things and stuff. Okay. Corvax word for aid. Nice word to be able to say. Nice word to have in the back pocket. I'm going to collect all these knowledge stones before I move forward. Because, quite frankly, more words is always nice to have. Immediately. Demand the aid immediately. Okay. That I knew was dangerous. This, I'm not even sure if I have scanned. I do. Booyah. This thing is so wild to look at. Green Oxium right here. Massive tusks and then a hardened-ish shell, it looks like, on the back. It's so weird to look at. It's cool. Corvax word for M. Interesting. I never scanned it bushes around here, I guess. Or at least that particular bush. Okay. Before I let go again. Whoa, what was this? Sentient plant. Ooh, this will piss off sentinels for sure if I start taking things away from them. But I must know. I must also collect carbon and oxygen. Whoop. Of course the sentinel is really close. Hi there. Bye. Leave me alone. Well, like... Oh, yeah, that's a bug. <laughs> Every time I hear that sound, I'm like, what is that? Wait a second. Are these what I think they are? Maybe. Possibly. It's still a ways away. But it is in that direction. So. I was about to say I want to confirm if that's what I think it is first. Before I go ahead and go after the thing that will surely get sentinels sent in my direction trying to murder me. So, get that out of the way now. Yep, and I overheat it. And the multi-tool is not showing any animations currently. That's an occasional bug that isn't all that fun. Yep, albumin pearls. And it immediately set off the sentinels because they are now looking for me. I told you it would. I told you. It's weird. The albumin pearls that are on the surface, they get pissed off if I do anything to them. Hi there. Uh oh. Oh boy. <laughs> Time to run now. Okay. Time to pull out the pulse spitter. Oh my god, it's one of those. Two of those. Oh jeez. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh jeez. Okay. Time to <laughs> fall down. <laughs> Keep running. Ah, oh, shit. Alright. Maybe if I fly upwards, I can evade their detection. Maybe. Oh. Ow. That hurt. That hurt a lot. Ow. Oh, crap. Almost. Almost gone. Oh, crap. Again. Yeah. Yeah, I know. I know. 
I'm aware. Ah, uh, crap, they keep detecting me and I can't evade them for much longer. Uh, not like this. Oh, boy. Ha ha. Ha ha. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Ooh. That was a little too close. Okay, as long as they're staying over there and away from me, I'm fine with this arrangement. <laughs> oh, boy. But just to scan so I know where is what. I can also try not to hit the Sentinel. That would piss them off even further. Actually send them in my direction. Those are still carbon crystals. There we go. All right. Okay. Cool. I scanned you, but now I have. About to say if you <laughs> if you went after that, so call shenanigans. All right. Time to go back to where I had ran away from. Whoop. Never scanned you either. Perfect. Gustave. N. Gustave. Hmm. Interesting. Any more of these? Oh, ooh, there is. It's hard to see them in the grass is blue. But you can see them. You scan in just the right way. And... Whoop. There's a, another pile over there, but I don't need to go after that. What I need to do... Is go back to those... <laughs> to those things over here. Oh, you're kidding me. There's still an... Oh... Eat my... Higher ass. Alright. Yep, the opening them up is fine, but the minute you grab the pearl, that's when they get pissed off. Oh, jeez. And they just appeared out of thin air, literally. Boy. Whoa, what is that? If that's what I think it is, I'm running over there. To avoid these guys. That's what I think it is. That looks like a whole bunch of... Oh, it is. It is a whole bunch of... Condensed carbon. Oh, my good golly goodness. <laughs> good golly goodness, what am I? <laughs> oh, gee willikers. <laughs> am I a doofus in the 60s? The answer is... Probably yes, but that's not the point. That's not the point. Oh geez. overheating. All right. Oh, you're still hunting me. Interesting. Also, so are they. Okay. Well, I'm hoping to avoid their detection. And if you're the only thing I'm dealing with, then it shouldn't be too bad. Oh. I see a yellow marker. A yellow marker. I haven't seen all that much. Makes me think that might be what I'm looking for. It is. It is what I'm looking for. I'm still being hunted at the same time. Go away! I didn't ask for you. No one asked for you. No one likes you. You don't even go to the school. Go away. Uh, the fact that I'm still marked as hunted, even though I haven't done anything... Well, I mean, I've been mining here and there, but that's not the point. I'm so far away, they should not be able to see me. Like at all. Bullshit. Straight up bullshit. Oh, fuck you! Oh, 
Okay. Well, that one was mainly all misses, but it's fine. Nope. Okay. Okay. It helps if I'm aiming at the actual critical point I'm shooting at. Ow. What if I can override the healing that's getting... No, no, I can't. Screw it. Get out of here. Dismal failure! Run away! I know, I know, it's low. Technically, so is my life. So, you could get off my back, maybe? The what? Oh. Alright, maybe, maybe if I do this maneuver. Maybe if I do this maneuver. Oh, come on. Come on. Ow, that one hurt. Oh, finally, I'm out of their reach. Out of their range. Holy crap, I didn't expect that. I'm going to see if I can hide underground. At least for a little while. Whew. Oh, boy. Oh, gosh. Oh, jeez. Oily coating. Ugh. Brody. <sighs> as long as I hide in here, I should be fine. I just had to piss him off again. I just had to piss him off again. Uh. Oh yeah, I'll steal more albumin pearls. You need to make all the money. Uh. Piss them all off at me for like the umpteenth time again. <laughs> I'm done. I am done. Oh, of course you are. Well, at least you're not paying attention to the fact I'm mining the heavy crystals you're supposed to be protecting, but okay. Cool. That worked out. Ow. Go away. Go away, please. Thank you. Alright. And... It looks like there's a hidden technology around here. Actually, seems like it should be closer. There's that. I knew it was close. I hit the wrong button. There we go. Pulled it out. And now I have another four. Nice. There we go. I should reload this. <laughs> well, I have an opportunity to Okay, and I had a feeling that there'd still be one hanging around, and of course it's going to scan me. Hi. Yes, I wasn't the criminal you were just hunting earlier. No, not at all. God, I should open these. Ooh. All the dihydrogen. That's all I needed. Um, put this on the freighter because I have spots on that currently for them. And you know, I'm going to make that to dust first before I do anything else. Oh, boy. Oh, yeah. I'm going to check that thing out. I think. Ooh. Almost missed this. And should have scanned this too. Corvax word for system. Interesting. Well then, I should very quickly do this thing. Very quickly. Quickly as I can manage. Especially because these things are still sitting around here. I approach the source of the signal. A hologram appears. It is Artemis, but there is only silence. A slow pulse of cosmic noise in the signal. Ask if they're alright. If Artemis can hear me, they make no sign. 
The hologram just stares. It's strange, but I feel a sense of deja vu. As if I've been right here before, right at this very moment. What is wrong? As I move closer, the Artemis projection begins to speak, their words punctuated by a strange static. They came. Watch closely. Machines. Murderers. Against the... The voice falls silent. The projection looks at me. Something is very wrong. Scan the hologram. I scan the hologram. It bears the exact same signature as every other transmission I have received from Artemis. There is no ulterior source for the signal. Everything they have said appears to have come from right in front of me. As I stand here, Artemis begins to speak. Where are... <laughs> Called them, but still beloved. Anomaly, they... Not a... Polo, watching us. Tracking. Mistake. Abandoned, but it wasn't... Through the portal. Please, don't trust... I'm afraid. Aren't... The projection fizzles away to mere static. This echo is all that is left of the entity known as Artemis, a grave of glitched data trapped in a sunless reality. My friend is dead. Perhaps they were never alive. I must tell Apollo what I have seen. Well, yeah, I figured that would be a thing. I need to get out of here as quickly as humanly possible. At least the superheated atmosphere allows my jetpack to work better. Okay, we Available, and... And I want to get one more word before I get on my ship. I'm going to have to call over to here anyway. I.E.? That's weird, but alright. Oh, I don't even need to call my ship at this point. Well, I mean, I will eventually, but... Not to save my behind. Good. That's all I could ask for. Oh, boy. That was something. So, Artemis was dead the whole time. Very sixth sense of the game. <laughs> okay. Still. Ooh. More. We got inside. Viking effigy. Fair enough. Um, hmm. Put more of it in there. And I will pull this ferrite dust out and begin. One rusted metal becomes two ferrite dust. That is hard to beat, honestly. This, we're gonna do the residual goop. Brody. Love itself. In the grave. Just kinda will sit there. It's unfortunate, but it is what it is. Sadly. This is 
and the long arms. Let's say I knew that was dihydrogen. I knew it. I knew it. Okay. Um. Where's a hollow terminus? Ah! That way. And it's like 10 minutes away. That ain't terrible. Just bring my ship over here. I keep hitting the wrong buttons. Because I'm a doofus. What, what do you mean, Red? Okay. Now it wants to cooperate. And get into the ship. And get out of here. Wee. 51. <laughs> I need to get better freaking launch thrusters on this. I need to add the B... Uh, what was it? The B uh, class upgrade that allows it to do more of those. Alrighty. Away we go. Let's boost our way over there. Okay. Oh, and there's another thing over there. Presuming that is the hollow terminus. Since this is the approximate location. No. No, it's not. Interesting. Alright. Well, since this is the approximate location. Oh, hello. Well, I'm not turning this down in the slightest, but right now, yeah, screw it. I'll be able to get to the uh, thing in a second. Right now, I want to get what's going on here. Oh, this was a big one. Ooh. I was hoping there's a lot of loot in here. So the hope is, anyway. Butcher of Byzantisup. Okay. Log extraction complete. Life goes on, day after day, delivering after... Psst. I hope to go home soon. The life of a... It's not one for me. Multiple sentinel energy signatures detected, requiring immediate... <laughs> Dropping out of warp. They're... They're sent... The sentinels. What are they doing? <laughs> Fighting each other. Sentinel ships are engaging each other. <laughs> Ignoring us for now. The sentinels appear to have departed. They're... <laughs> Distress signal nearby. Broadcasting 16 on repeat. I'm going to take a look. So they also noticed the 16. some bio-input sensor and just some chromatic metal will be enough. And get out of here, because that's going to hit some radiation levels that I don't want. Yeah, no, I noticed. And I got out of there about as quickly as I could. Alright. And there's some of these boxes that are going to be underneath the ground, so I'll need to dig for them a little bit, too. More chromatic metals. Bet. Oh boy. Hot ice. Okay. I can use that. Eventually. Pretty sure I don't have all the recipes for it right now, but I can use it eventually. Now the other 
buried caches. Uh, I already know the unknown building. Wait, no, it's not there. What am I thinking of? At least I... Maybe it is? Some of them are over here, even. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It might be. Ow. There we go. And then we just dig downwards. Until we reach it. And we dig around it. Until we can open it. And currently... Oh, there we go. Open by repairing damaged components. And we're back out of here. Multi-tool expansion slot? Multi-tool expansion slot? looking for? Maybe. Okay. That. That one I meant. I meant to mine it. Alright. Need to get in there somehow. Ah. That's what I should have been looking for right there. And now we beat this thing down. And <laughs> more digging. For some reason. Okay. Man. There's a lot more dirt in here than you would expect, considering, you know, it crashed here. And it won't let me do anything else there. Okay. Time to run. Time to run. Unstable gel. That's good. That's a thing I can use. But that'd be later. Okay. Cargo pod. Another one. There's a cargo pod over there, too. Okay. Well, considering... How much I could be getting out of all of this should I just continue the mining expedition I'm doing. Oops. Go ahead and continue doing this. Just for the time being, it's giving me a lot of materials that I can use later. Costing me a little bit of chromatic metal. Ooh, that gave me a bunch of units. That's hard to beat. So that's done. That one still needs to be done. Alright. There we go. Oh, and my refiner's done. I just noticed that it's not making the noise anymore. It would only help if I hit the right button. Viscous fluids now. Now it has to turn into living slime. Take about a minute. So that's how long I have to take to do this. Beautiful. Okay, so that's not the direction. That's the direction. Okay. And that's... Just a quick... Pop in and get out. Ah, I salvaged all of the materials from the wreck. Interesting. Are we sure? Are we sure I did that? Are we sure I did all of that? I don't know about that. I don't know. Okay. Well, that's good enough, I guess. Uh, okay. Where's I heading again? Oh, geez. <laughs> it's a lot further than I thought it would be. Okay. 
time to get to my ship. Okay. I thought it was going to be closer. Didn't think it would be a thousand... five hundred away. Alright. Whoop. Shouldn't go that way. Should go this way. It's more open. Wee. Alright. Just gotta look for Terminus. It's not over this way. Where could... Ah. Uh, there we are. Time to land. Time to talk to Apollo. About what I found. And what I found is weird. again. Holy crap. Oh, boy. Oh, gosh. That's <laughs> still so wild to look at. And I know Reggie probably censored me while I was swearing at it because it was too early in the episode, but whoa, man. Like, how, how do you not respond with holy fuck to that? I mean, really? Alright, warning. Network compromised. Warning. Manual override required. There are no signal matches for Artemis or Apollo. The terminal is a stream of warnings and errors. Okay, perform a manual override. The warning messages cease. Some new frequency shimmers into being. Break. 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 Data stream overridden. Who are you? No. You are not alone. Tell me, what's the point in living if we know that life will finish? Death does not erase life. But it does. All those moments, gone. Everything that came before, meaningless. I know you, Traveler. I know where you've been. I know where you're going. What if I told you that Artemis could be saved? What if I told you that Artemis could live once more after a fashion? What would you do then, I wonder? I need to know more before I commit to something like that. A skeptic. Well, Artemis was already dead. Your journey to save them has failed. What do you have to lose? The blood of Artemis's data. The heart, its glitch. I can help you retrieve them both. We require a mind arc. A receptacle for their soul. Can you do that for me? I am reactivating Artemis's frequency. Speak with them when you are ready. The stranger offers me blueprints for something they call the Mind Arc, a device they claim will allow me to restore Artemis to life. So you just come out of the blue to help me bring back Bruce Willis Artemis from their dead state because they've been dead the entire time. Apparently. And... I'm just supposed to trust you. That that is how it actually will go. Okay. Also, wow! Fucking trash truck is really loud today. If you calm it down a little bit. My gods. 
You're ruining my moment here. All right. Either way. Okay. Might as well accept it. I accept, not knowing who the stranger is or how they possess such knowledge of my adventures. But if there is a chance that I can help Artemis, I will take it. The Mind Arc and the Soul Engine. And there's Artemis again. Are you... Are you... Are you... Artemis repeats these two words endlessly, unable to see my face or hear my voice. I must craft the mind arc before I can help them further. My cad... Cadmium? I'm pretty sure I have cadmium on my freighter, but... <clears throat> All right, where is my freighter? It's in the Anelin system. And I already have a base there. So I can at least go back. Okay. Time to summon the freighter. Booyah. And with that, I should be able to make it. I would hope. I already have cadmium. I need living pearls and metal plating. Come on. Uh, you're busting my balls here, game. Okay, so this is going to take a little longer than I expected. The living pearls shouldn't be that hard. I just need to find oceans to do it. But... Uh, oh, man. This whole thing is going to be a endeavor. And a half. At least most of this is easy to do. Okay, living slime. Convert that. And it's almost done. Okay. So, I will sort all of this crap out. And I will get done what I can do in the meantime. Uh, namely, making glass. But I still will need to find a living pearl. At least the glass and the freaking. At least the glass is easy and the metal plating is easy. The living pearl. I have no idea if this planet even has an ocean. Nah. So. I'll look into that. But for now. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the game we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat. Playing games and trying to help Artemis now. Because now we know he's dead and he's been Bruce Willising the entire time. But we're going to try and bring him back with the help of this Null character. Who I still have no idea who or what they are. But I have a suspicion. I have a suspicion. I'm not sure if I will claim it as fact. But I have a suspicion. And I'll work on everything else. While I work on that. Idea. Following thing. English is hard. You know what I'm meaning. For you.